So we have been talking about organization. We've been sneaking into her DMs to get questions for this segment because <laughs> she gets so many. So here's one that she got. She says, uh, this person said, I hate the messiness of my belts. I am with you. There has to be something out there to keep them tidy. Please help. Yes. Can you help? I can help. And yeah, belts are a pain. They are. You know, even if you roll them up nicely, you move one and they all fall over. Or they all. So this is the time and place where you're going to buy something to help you with this organization. Can I admit that mine have elastics on them at home? No, actually, that's really great. I've done that before. It's really ugly. It's ugly, yes, yeah. but whatever. F function whatever. over fashion, as yes. they say. Um, <laughs> so that is actually a good method. And the reason why, for those who don't know, don't know I'm assume, Tracy, you put it around yeah. the width yeah. so they don't unravel and it keeps them tight. Mm -hmm. The only bad thing about that is if the elastic's too tight, it'll permanently mark in the leather. Sure does. Yeah. <laughs> So just sure be aware does. of that. Use a loose elastic or ribbon. Uh -huh. But we're going to kind of give it, make the storage problem also something pretty. Yeah. So the, I love this. It's a stackable container that can be used for your belts. So obviously all you do oh is put gosh. the belts into each container and stack them one on top of another. I love this for a couple of reasons. One, if you don't have space in a drawer or somewhere like that, this can easily sit on top of a like a vanity or your mm -hmm. dresser or even your bedside table if you're in a really micro space. Yeah. And it keeps everything nice and tidy and you can see your stuff. If you can't see it, you're not going to use it. You're not going to wear it. You're not going to use it. You yep. have to be able to see it. I also like that these, they because they're stackable, they've got little magnets so that lid like sticks. they have little lids. You can, if you don't have a tall space, you can make them two shorter ones. Yeah. You can kind of merchandise your space a little bit mm -hmm. and you can make them, you know, kind of in a decorative pattern. You can do whatever you want. But we're also going to take this to another level. These are multi-use, so if you only have one or two belts, these come as a set. So you buy them all in one. Yeah. Got them from Amazon. Um, you can use these for other things like, oh, Q-tips and cotton pads and whatever you want. Jewelry, like necklaces and bracelets. Uh, you know, uh, we've got someone around here that loves acrylic nails, so yes. you can make one of these to your acrylic nail kits. Yes. There's just so many. So many reasons to use containers like this. They just look so perfect for the belts, though. They look so perfect for the belts. I love them belts. for the belts. Now, now, you've got another solution. Yeah, if you have a drawer space or, you know, these round ones don't work, this yeah. fits perfectly into a drawer, and then they hold, they're like little holsters for each one. Yes. And what I will point out, is you can see this belt, it's got a bit of a wider buckle. Mm -hmm. So it doesn't actually fit into here. Mm -hmm. So measure what you have. Make sure what you have. This belt's going to live with you for the next long term. Let's hope we are because we're buying better. Right. right. We're buying less and we're buying better now. Yeah. So if this is a 20-year belt, let's make sure the storage suits it. Absolutely. So just be, a, be aware of that. There's nothing more disappointing. You get it and nothing fits in it. Oh, I've been there. Right? Been so there. have I. Yeah. Okay, another question. I love my shoes and I am not getting rid of any of them, but I'm running out of space. <laughs> Help! Wait, did you send me that? Because that is a very Tracy Moore thing me. to say. No. It might have been me. I love Help it. me. No, I'm a shoe girl too. So I'm a big fan of these shoe organizers. Mm -hmm. And they are amazing because you put a shoe in the bottom and you put another one in the top and Beautiful. they literally double up your space. Yeah. Right? Because you're only now using on a shelf one width of shoe. Right. These are great, but we're going to make it even better. They always okay. kind of come out with the new things. And this is the newer version of this, and I love them. They function the very same, but as you can see, you can set the top one at a higher level. And that matters because if you have a slipper or a little ballet flat like mm. this, you only need the low. Mm -hmm. If you've got a medium shoe, like a sneaker running shoe, mm. then you have that. And if you've got the fabulous high heels or a boot or something, mm -hmm. then you can have it higher because this high heel, for example, doesn't fit all the way underneath this right. one. And it's terrific Beautiful. because if you are doing shelves that are movable, like in some kind of like a, you know, a armoire type thing where the yes. shelves are in your closet, you could do a whole row of low shoes and lower the shelf, whole row of medium, lower the shelf, and you could get maybe For even a whole class. extra shelf of shoe space in these. This is important. Yes, yes, because we're not giving away shoes. Information, yeah. <laughs> right? Very good, Shona. Yeah, yeah. You can shop all of these incredible organizing accessories by clicking the QR code on your screen right now, and that will allow you to shop the show.